David, today is the day I get to become your wife. Today, before God, our families, and friends, I pledge to live my life forever committed to you. There were many moments before I met you when I felt like this day would never come. There were days when I thought I'd be alone forever. You were completely worth the wait. If I had to be alone and wait 10 more years, I would do it in a heartbeat. Dude, you're working that camera right now. I'm feeling it. Cool. Best man has got it. I suppose the ways that I love you can't be counted, mostly because in the short amount of time that we've known each other, I've seen new parts of Elisa pop out that I didn't know were there. It's exciting and remarkable, and one of the craziest parts about being in a marriage. I would guess, though I've never been married, is that only God truly knows you. I will never know you as well as him, and you know that too, and that makes me love you more and more. You are everything and more I could have ever wanted. I am beyond thrilled to start our lives together and build a family. I'm also excited to become one. So whatever we do, wherever we go, wherever we live, wherever we go to church, whoever we give birth to, whoever we adopt, however we spend the rest of our lives worshiping him, it's the two of us now as one. different. So there's me and I'm considered the crazy one, I guess. I don't know why. I mean, I have a good job, right? So uh, then there's Andrea. She was the book smart one, the perfectionist. And then we have Elisa, the beautiful Disney princess. And anybody who knows Elisa knows that she literally is a Disney princess. I mean, in every way possible. I think every musical, she was a Disney princess. And for anybody who has ever heard her sing, she sings like one as well. And every day it's, someday my prince will come. And here he is. <laughs> Dip you right out. Nobody wants to see it, you guys. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god. She is truly exactly what you see in the movie. She's talented. She has a heart of gold. She treats everybody so well. Uh, she's beautiful to boot. She's everything you could ever imagine, and that's my baby sister. <laughs> Today I'm promising to stand by your side forever and love you till death do us part. I want you to know that I take these vows very seriously and I mean every word of them. The person beside whom you stand right now is God's greatest gift to your life and you will find true satisfaction nowhere else. I, David, take you, Elisa, to be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. You may now kiss your bride. for the very first time, Dr. and Mrs. David Wilk. David.
did, uh, you know, he's intense. Strength, determination, merciless forever. You got 10 years of uh, med school on top of it, and it's like, whoa. <laughs> so at least right away, you're just like a shot of Xanax straight to the neck, and just, you know, really helped him relax. <laughs> Anything I could say about David would be an understatement. Trust me when I tell you I liked him from the very moment I met him. And one of the things I like best about David is that he makes Elisa so very happy. David, take care of my little sister. Treat her like the princess that she is. Love her like we love her. And always remember in the back of your mind, my dad's got a lot of guns. Finally, I just want to say to Dr. Pettigrove and Mrs. Pettigrove, um, I'm absolutely in love with your daughter. Uh, I'm crazy about her. I want to explode. Okay? She's unbelievable. I can't believe I actually get to marry her. Uh, it's, I, it's, it's totally... Oh, yeah. We're married? We're married?